right so just came to the animal room obviously because my roaches have not had their water yet so yeah, i'm gonna have to give them the water and my gosh why do these terrestrials keep thinking they're arboreals no no you guys are terrestrials man be terrestrials <laughs> so yeah my roaches i made this uh earlier today in the morning now it's like 1 a.m i think so better give them their water because they've not had water for i would say two days and for roaches you really don't want them to be without water for extended periods of time they can go without food for a long time but for water i would suggest you give them water readily access to water i mean yeah uh, kind of a mess but oh actually they do have some water it's food that they don't have but now tomorrow i'm gonna have to clean out all of the poop and then i'll replenish their food but as for now oh hello you guys can see miss thailand black is out but yeah i'm gonna have to take out some dead what you call that roaches because despite me giving them water crystals they still tend to die in the water dish for some reason man there's a lot of babies check that out but yeah man look at that so yeah what i'm gonna be doing is i'm going to when i clean this out i'm going to scoop I, I will film it so yeah you guys will see i'm going to pretty much clean up i mean like uh what you call that scoop out all of the poop and i am not going to separate the roaches what i am going to do is let me pour this what i am going to do is well give my friend whatever dubias that are left in the poop so i think that, that should be good yeah and then this will be for the turks so yeah they can come have a nice drink better close it first because lizards tend to find their way in and always give me jump scares when i open the bin okay so yeah it wasn't the dubias that were out of water crystals i think it was the turks because i remember that yep it was the turks because i remember that one roach bin was uh missing some was requiring some food i mean not food uh water crystals sorry about that but what are all these man why are you putting all these in your water dish it's just gonna cause mold you guys should know better that mold is not good for you okay so now just put some water crystals in here should be good i mean they're turks they're so small look at all the eggs at the back there and the thing is a lot of my adults died off now we're only left with look at that all the babies so yeah i mean we do still have some adults but pretty much mostly are the young ones which are fine i mean they grow decently quick look at that 
So yeah, as you can see, that's a meal. We're going to drink some water because, yeah, I'm pretty sure they're thirsty. Quite thirsty. Alright, so, I guess that is it. I just wanted to show you guys, I mean, I usually film everything on this channel and yeah everything seems to be doing okay so far so good Ooh, skeleton tarantula is out his trochrate is gigas very very big girl but yeah that is pretty much it i guess oh yeah and also i wanted to <laughs> i regret not filming this so i had i i just bought this thermostat right and then we wired it up, me and my dad. And then when I plugged it in, I turned it on. The whole, uh, what do you call that? The, what was the word that I used? The whole thermostat. Yeah, that's the word. The whole thing just exploded. So I, I have no idea why. <laughs> so weird. I I'll show you guys the thermostat. Let's just go out of the animal room. Sorry if you can hear a car outside. But yeah, let me show you. Okay. This guy's just sleeping here. Okay, so <laughs> this thermostat, I plugged it into the uh, heat mat and we followed all of the instructions to wire it up. But then when I plugged it in, turned it on this whole thing just went boom so yeah it's pretty much burnt out and <laughs> i can't use it well rip my money oh well that's fine wasn't too expensive anyway but man what a pity did not even try i mean i mean we did try but <laughs> whatever